Hello! Welcome to LMC and Knowledge, Lyric's music channel of spiritual insight and wisdom that I will share to you so you can take along your spiritual journey. I hope you're having a good day, good night, wherever you're at, and whenever you see this, make sure that you're prayed up and in that light of Jesus. Okay? Okay. So, before we get into this message, I will use my shamanic drum to cleanse the space, clear the energy, and we will go from there. Before we get into this message, I wanted to let you guys know that I'm a rapper and I'm a singer and I have music. You can go to my playlist on this channel to check out my new music and my old music, but it might be new to you if you haven't heard it. Um, I have a music video that I dropped December 2nd. I'm pushing that one, you know. I want the world to see that. Um, and I would love for you to see it if you haven't seen it. And it's called You Go and See, okay? <laughs> So if you have supported that song and watched it, I love you so much. And I would appreciate if you share it to your friends, your family, somebody who you think would like that song too. Um, I would appreciate that. My spirit guides, they be watching. They be like, oh, they support, they support. Okay, we finna help you. Like my spirit guides help, they're helpers, like big helpers when it comes to like, you support me, how deep you support me. My spiritual team gonna make sure that you're supported, even with your spiritual team. You know what I mean? So... With that being said, I have another song called Earth Angel, and I would love for you guys to listen to that. I'll put the link in the comments for both of those songs, or you can just go to my playlist and you can see a lot of it. So, yeah, with that being said, the intuitive message of today is your energy is so powerful, it can enhance and elevate people's lives, okay? You are... Your bloodline is a part of a a healthy foundation. You're rooted on a firm, like very strong roots. I'm seeing like at the mantle of the earth, like a tree going all the way down to the mantle, going down so many levels, um, not in a bad way, but you know, just going to the core of earth. And actually like I'm seeing a long bridge that's just fluid, fluid of high vibrational energy that your bloodline and your people who are on this earth that are in your bloodline they can pull on that energy and use that energy and also give back to that energy give back to that energetic bridge of prosperity and like literally i'm seeing like your ancestors helping other people who are in their bloodline and they've done this before you guys are helpers and it's like you'll be covered or something like that like things will be even when you feel like it's not going your way, it's going your way, is what I'm hearing. Um, it's going the way it needs to be. But with that being said, you being able to help these people out of financial baggage, burdens, karmic cycles, it's like you, your energy is so big that when you come around people for long periods of time who are in like, rocky situations in their life it's like your spiritual team surrounds the whole entire area that you're at so whatever room you're in whoever you're around they like to scan the souls around you and see what they need help on they help them through their health like they send them uh i'm seeing your spiritual spirit guides tapping into their phones and sending them certain herbs or certain spiritual messages or, to help them or or yoga or mudras like these people are getting you may find yourself talking to the people around you more about spirituality and it's because they're awakening because of you and it's like you're so powerful to the point where you don't have to say too much for this energetic tra transaction to happen and it's not of um obviously you having the, the discernment on who to give your energy out so you can intentionally say i'm giving this energy from my prosperity bridge to such and such you can say that for this reason and um 
I'm hearing somebody say, I give high amounts of my inner, my energetic bridge to this person who deeply needs it. Like you, you ask your spiritual team for them to help your friend or your family, somebody you, you're just, you have access to prosperity is what I'm saying. Longevity, but it goes for any and all forms of life. So with you being obedient or you staying pure or staying in a high vibration, you may need to charge up if you want to do something like this for someone or even yourself. Sometimes um, things are delayed. It's never not working. Your your prayers, your, your spells, your whatever you're conjuring energetically, positively, it's never not happening that's one thing i wanted to tell you guys and it's either delayed and you have to figure out why is it delayed sometimes certain people aren't ready for what you're giving them sometimes you aren't ready for what you want for yourself or sometimes there's blockages and then once you identify those blockages and it's all energetically limitations negative thoughts belief systems certain habits and patterns that we have to let go of that will give us access to that prosperity bridge, you know? Um, but yes, you you guys definitely come here to help other bloodlines. Build the foundation of other uh, soul teams. Because we are soul teams on this on this earthly realm, right? We all got our group of who we need to be with. Some are scattered. Then we eventually meet up in divine timing and stuff like that. But some spiritual teams need help. And you're those people that help them, is what I'm hearing. So, yeah. I had seen this. Oh, this is nice. This is nice. It's kind of here. Okay. So we got foundation and achievements and prosperity begins 41. You might be 41. Um, Spiritual number. I mean, life path number five, or you could be a spiritual number five could be significant for you. Um, Yeah. Spiritual number 14, life path 14. Um, Yeah. So with that being said, with the foundation of achievements and prosperity begins, that's literally what I was saying. Like, what the heck? With the foundations, like, you, this is what you can do. You you set people up for success. So this may be in your career or something. Um, something with managing money. You're really good at managing money or you're finding new ways to manage your money. Are you teaching people how to save money or something like that? But like I said, you may be here to build buildings for people, homes, a community. I'm getting Native American energy right now. And it's like, I'm picturing villages, but this is like past life type of energy. Villages with, and you you and your community are building it. Like you're, I'm seeing you point out like, okay, this is where we're going to have this one at. Um, the fire set up or the um TP or the how they built it, you know, and what they use. It's like you're you knew the blueprint. I'm seeing you with like a your scroll and like a feather with ink on it, and you already knowing exactly where things need to go. Like I'm just seeing you built foundations for people. You gave people homes. You gave or you you can make a house a home type of energy is what I'm hearing. But you get people off the streets. Maybe you're helping the homeless or something like that. But prosperity begins. I'm seeing you lay your hand on these people's seeds. Like you on top of this hand. And remember I said rooted with a tree in the ground. Okay, okay. So you help people plant their seeds in life. So you may help people with their career. You may help people with their dreams. You may be an executive over something. But I'm saying any, everything that you touch turns to gold. It's like this person was having a hard time for things to grow. And then when you came, it just started sprouting. So let me put this one right. Oh, this is dope. 14. And this was number four. Well, four and one. And I'm saying 14. That is really significant. 4, 14 may be significant. 14, 14 may be significant. But patience. It's like these people were trying to plant their seeds, you know. But and they had to have patience. You were also you also teach people perseverance, or you let them know like if you're consistent, it's gonna be. I know this is a flower, but let's just act like it's a tree, a small tree growing, right? Then if you're consistent, then boom, we can do this. So it's like you working together with people for a, a good amount of time to see their growth, like, um, yeah. And then you're gonna get repaid. Like it's like I'm seeing somebody build somebody up right or give them access to something you having a connection towards something and then they plant that seed right 
And obviously that's not enough for a whole bunch of people. But then it starts growing. And they're like, you know what? Since you blessed me, I'm going to bless you again. So I'm seeing these apples or these peaches coming to you. So it's like they're giving you their fruit now. You know what I mean? You helped them. You gave them the seed. Now they're giving you the fruits. Um, and they still got some for themselves, obviously. But it's like, that's what I'm seeing that you do for people. You really elevate people's lives. So you definitely have to make sure they deserve it. Make sure that you're using your discernment. Um, because you, your blue eyes, like we, we love people. We're generous. We are, but with certain souls and with certain spiritual teams, because some people will F up the ball. They'll, they'll lose the ball. You know what I mean? Like I gave you the ball. So where's that now? When they're like, well, you know, what happened was we don't want to hear that. We want to know for a fact that this is going to be worth it, you know, because when they build like this. It actually sends stronger, more more powerful energy to that prosperity bridge and makes it even more powerful. So not only are you guys doing it on Earth, you guys are also doing the same thing on another planet. Whatever planet that clicks in your head right now is the planet that you're doing this on too. You're helping otherworldly beings that live a whole different life because this bridge is connected to this planet, to the planet that you are, um, your highest self is located at right so yeah this is big but yeah i love you guys and i'll see you in my next video peace